And we're back. Coming at you this time with a breakfast recipe. That's right, peach and ricotta pancakes. Let's make them. As always, the full recipe is in the description below. So let's start with our dry ingredients. We're gonna add some flour, some baking powder, salt, and sugar to a bowl. Then we're gonna whisk these together just to get them incorporated. Next, we're gonna move on to the wet ingredients. Take a ricotta, one egg yolk, some vanilla, and then add some milk. This is actually oat milk, which is fine to use if you can't have real milk. And lastly, our peaches. Then we're just gonna mix everything up until it's incorporated. You can definitely use any fruit that you want, but uh, we had peaches on hand because it is summer, so that's what we used. Next, we're gonna mix our dry ingredients into our wet ingredients. Just do this slowly because you wanna make sure you avoid any lumps. There's definitely nothing tastier than a flower pocket. As you can see, I'm just kind of mixing and then like folding it over itself and mixing some more. Once it's mixed together, just set it to the side because we have a little work to do on the next step. In a different bowl, you're gonna add one egg white and then whisk. And you're gonna do a lot of work here because you can see this hasn't been sped up and we're working towards stiff peaks. But magically, <laughs> we have stiff peaks. Now take those fluffy egg whites and slowly add them to the mixture. Once again, you wanna to try to do this as gently or as, I don't know, non-violently as possible. This time we're not trying to avoid lumps though, we wanna keep all the air in those egg whites. Now it's time to cook. I don't know that I need to explain how to do that. If you enjoyed this recipe, please like, comment, subscribe, and share with all your friends. Yeah, definitely do that. If you only knew how many times it took me to get the perfect flip, there you go, pancakes worthy of a dance. Woo!